In some ways, Yehuda Sabiner is like any other med student. In other ways, he's very different. While there are countless Jewish doctors, up until recently, not a single Hasidic Jew had gone to med school in Israel. My name is Yehuda Sabiner. I am 28 years old. At four years old, Yehuda loved his pediatrician so much, he decided he too wanted to be a doctor one day. I remember myself also asking him with the doctors getting the red sirens and lights to the car. His family thought it was just a cute childhood fantasy and didn't give it much thought. But Yehuda's dream never died. As I grew up, I saw also that the profession is very attracting me because of um, the high intelligence and the amount of chesed and help you can aff afford to your other fellows. I told my parents in the Shabbat, Shabbat dinner that I still want to be a doctor. My mother had uh, tears in her eyes and she said, I thought we passed the our time with you. Surprisingly, my father told me, you know what, now you have to study. What are you going to do it? As I raise Shemaim after wedding, you're going to get my support. Although most Jewish girls dream of marrying a doctor, this was not the case for Yehuda Sabiner's wife. When he confessed his dream to his newlywed wife, she cried the whole night. But the second day she came to me and she said, um, I am not the one that's going to ruin your dream. Two weeks later, he was enrolled in a course for Haredim to get his prereqs in order to apply to med school. Two years after it, I finished with an uh, average of 99 and I was accepted to the medical school of Technion. The Technion is known to be um, one of the top universities in Israel and in the world. So the first day at the medical school was very strange. The guard in the entrance stopped me. Are you the new kosher supervisor? And when I said not, he didn't let me to go inside until I showed him a student card. Now, eight years later, nearly 35 other Haredi Jews have followed Yehuda's lead and gone to med school. One year after I was in medical school, I already established an organization called Haredim in Medicine that provides all the knowledge and all the support that boys and girls can, can enter a medical school. He's about to realize his childhood dream and become Israel's first Hasidic doctor. My take-home message is very clear that if you have um, faith, faith in something and you want to achieve something, you should just close your eyes and go straight and get it. <laughs>